um, did they explain to you why in the first place did you accept the mat and uh, how did you use it? That's just uh, just for the clarification. Moses Kuria. Yeah, yes, thank you, Madam Chair. Madam Chair, the agent who brought me this mat explained to me that this mat, that the reason why uh, one would feel uh, extreme cold on the feet and numbness is because of uh, the presence of toxins in the body. Uh, and I, I, and I briefed him for that. And he, he did not give me any other special instructions on how to use a mat other than telling me to step on the mat and just to put, uh, connect the mat to electricity and use it continuously for as long as I want. Uh, the longer the use, the better the results, according to him. It was supposed to be like uh, what they described as, as a network of stones uh, on top of the mat, which are supposed to be, to be doing the uh, iodizing, you know, uh, of, 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 of the body. So uh, just some, some smooth uh, stones on top of a mat connected to electricity. That, that's all I can see. Upon research, I did uh, try to look for secondary material, and I stumbled into a, a research or, or, or a report from, from the state of Texas in the United States of America, where I believe that the mother company of the, this company, Sarah Gem, they had their products banned in, in the state of Texas. And I believe they are still banned in the state of Texas because of uh, you know, fraudulent claim of, of, of curing cancer. Yeah, so uh, I really got scared when I got that report from Texas and I said, maybe even all these uh, ailments which this company is claiming to cure, maybe it also could be fraudulent as it was discovered in the state of Texas. So I have no capability to say whether the products are genuine or not genuine. That is the work of CAPS and the work of the Farmers and Reposers Board. And I believe that your esteemed committee has got the capability and the means to get down to see if they are licensed or not licensed. We operate in Kenya as Total Seragem Africa Limited. Is a business, as our business, we do the importation and distribution of thermal massage apparatus, thermal mats uh, made in South Korea with approval from uh, various organizations and especially also CAPS, the Kenya Bureau of Standards, locally. Just how does that mat work? Thank you. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, what we call Sarajem mat, the one uh, which I think. Sorry. Thank you. Uh, it's called Sarajem Ceramic M1 mat, which has been designed actually to for, 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 for the benefit of emitting the fine infrared heat, just basically to help with body's blood circulation. And um, it comes with... The, 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 it's a different, there are so many components, or uh, we can call their safety measures, which comes with this mat, whereby whenever the user is using the product, uh, you are able to regulate the amount of temperatures that are comfortable with you. It has been made of some serotonic stones, or there are natural stones brought together to form one stone which we refer to as serotonic stone. Now, with the technology that Seragem has done, it is able to help with the emission of the fine infrared heat, which is now able to help with so many things in terms of like relieving pain, if you have like a poor circulation uh, of blood, or like you have cold in the body, you're able to use it. This mat can be used in different ways. You can uh, step on it, you can lie on it, you can sit on it, you can cover yourself with it. Provided you just follow the instruction because it comes with a manual, there is a way you are supposed to use it. My colleague, Mr. Peter Kimani, uh, one thing he, actually the duration of using the mat also uh, matters, and also when you're using it for longer time, you need to regulate the temperature. So a good guidance on how to use it is very important.